guys, it's Lydia here from LA 3D Printing and today I'm going to be showing you guys and reviewing some of IO Robotics PLA filament. So let's get started. Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. So IO Robotics kindly sent me their 12 pack of PLA filament. So you can purchase this on their website which I will leave in the description below. And this is all of their filament, all their PLA filament that they do sell. So you can buy them individually, I believe for like $12.99. Um, or you can buy this large 12-pack uh, of all of the colors, which is really awesome. Their filaments are actually only 500 grams, which is great for beginner uh, 3D printers. If you don't know what kind of color you want or you don't know how much you want, you can buy a 500 gram spool from Isle Robotics and test that out and see if you like that color and then you can go buy a larger spool of that. Now again they sent me this 12 pack so I'm not sure if I'm going to be um, printing every single color in here but I will definitely be printing um, a couple little different things with them and I am also using uh, all these colors to print some new hands so I'm actually starting to print um, different hands instead of actually having to use elastic cord I'm going to be using like elastic rubber bands with the um, new design that Enable has out so um, I'm just gonna pick a box here I guess I'll just pick this red again they are small boxes um, and this is what it looks like the box is just plain it has it says PLA filament diameter 1.75 um, 500 gram spool and the temperature print temperature is 195 to 230 degrees uh, Celsius and the color is red and that is what it looks like so again the box is just plain and then pulling this out um, I did notice with opening a couple of the other boxes that this color um, on here is not always the exact same color as it is on here um, but this actually looks pretty pretty close to it so on the front here it says um, IO Robotics and then they also have a 3D printing pen and some filament little uh, test samples and then you can uh, use their QR code to go right to their website which again I will link in the description below. The other side is nice and shiny and it is definitely premium quality filament which is what it says here. So these are actually vacuum sealed bags very tightly and they actually have um, Ziplocs on them which I usually don't store my filament back in the Ziploc, uh, which you can do, but honestly it doesn't make a difference. Um, as you can see up there, I do not have anything in a Ziploc bag, um, maybe except for my nylon, just to keep it dry. But um, opening this bag, it comes with a big desiccant pack in the bottom there, and then again that little paper. But looking at the wounding right away, this filament is very straight, wound perfectly. Um, their spools are nice and heavy duty. Uh, I like how they have these open gaps here so you can see how much spool or how much filament you have left. They have their IO Robotics um, filament sticker here and then again the same sticker that was on the box is right down here which tells you everything um, and again on the same other side. And there is two different spots to put in your filament when you're done using it. And this color is just a very vibrant color which IO Robotics is known for. They have some very colorful filaments and um, yeah so again this spool looks like a very heavy duty spool the wounding is perfect this the actual spool looks like it's just glued together maybe snapped and glued together again there are only 500 gram spool filaments and um, that is okay because you can get this whole entire package of all different kinds of filaments and you won't even need a whole one kilogram roll of filament so let's go test all these filaments out on all my different printers and I'll see you guys after that <laughs> not using all the colors but I did use lots of the colors um, I think I didn't use maybe four or something more four or three colors uh, but I did print um, a couple useful things a couple cool little things um, and I actually printed a couple little parts for another bionic can that I'm gonna be building um, but yeah so I just want to let you guys know that this filament in the colors 
it all amazed me. Like, on the box, there's a little color thing, and I expected that color. But actually, you got a whole, in my opinion, a wholly different, whole different color. And honestly, those colors are really amazing. They're so bright and vibrant. As you can see, this lime green is just a beautiful, beautiful color, including the, like, the light blue and the orange, which I don't have up here right now. Um, but just the colors are so amazing, and how this filament printed was just beautiful. It printed nice and smooth. It was super easy to print with, and I'm really glad I actually got to test out all of their colors because they all look amazing, and I definitely do 100% recommend this awesome filament. So let's show you guys what all these filaments and prints look like up close and show you all the detail and beautifulness that this filament will give you. Alright guys, so we're going to start off with just a couple maker coins that I printed. I eventually decided to print these just because I thought they looked really cool. So this is actually um, just the plain white filament. It looks great once again. This is the awesome gray. Now on the box it looks a lot lighter, but this is actually a really darker gray. And then this blue is probably my favorite color out of all these. This blue is the um, called the dark blue, and honestly it just looks amazing. All these prints turn out really great on this. These were all printed on the uh, TiVo Flash and they just look great. The first layers went down so the support on here uh, came off but because it is a darker color you could see it more but over here you couldn't see it that much so I actually think these turned out really nice and I'm definitely loving this color. Next I decided to print uh, a bigger print and this was uh, the MakerBot and this guy's really cool and I'm surprised that he actually moves. I did scale him up a lot. I think this is 200% and honestly, again, I just love the color on how this looks. And I also printed a little 3D fill on this. This has zero perimeters, or zero infill, and two perimeters. And this filament is very strong and definitely, definitely worth their money. So in the darker blue, I printed um, a gullet for another hand. And then I also printed this cool little flower pot. I found this on Thingiverse. I'm not really sure how uh, this really works, but to me, it looks really cool. The details was great. Um, and honestly, again, this color just turned out amazing. So for the yellow filament, I printed a little fishing lure, and I also printed a uh, time-lapse jig up here. Um, Devin over at Make Anything designed this and printed it out, so I'm trying to figure out how to do it with my GoPro. So I also printed that in the yellow filament. And the last print I decided to print is this cool little iPad stand that, is, that I designed. Um, it turned out awesome, so it started out with blue and I thought there's not going to be or I don't want to waste all this blue filament so I decided to change out with pink and obviously I didn't expect it to be this tall so I use a lot more pink than expected but the transition between these two colors is like it never happened um, but this again this color is great I really do love this uh, pink it's a very nice pink it's a nice uh, smooth color and this blue again is just a very vibrant blue and I definitely love it so I also printed a little uh, self-watering flower pot and I'll put the picture right here. And I used the orange and the light blue and both of those are very beautiful prints. I printed the blue part on the Tivo Flash and the orange part on the Tivo Michelangelo. And again, they both turn out great and I definitely love all of these colors. Alright guys, so that is it for today's review on IO Robotics PLA Filament. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this. Again, go check them out. I will leave their link in the description below. And um, I believe once you get a roll, you get also a 20% off discount if you want to buy this whole entire 12-pack that I just reviewed for you guys. Um, and that is really awesome. They also do a, uh, I believe it's a weekly giveaway, so you can win some free filming, a free small spool. And um, they're just overall a great company, so definitely go check out their filming. Again, I really loved all the colors, and a lot of these colors are going to go to some cool new colorful hands, which I'm super excited about printing. So again, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.